Good evening, everybody. Welcome to a Geek Speak. Tonight, we have John O'Hurley for a quick chat. We're going to talk about child help, ultimate goal and uh ultimate golf. golf excuse me yes and uh and his role in that we'll be right back after a quick intro you're tuning in to geek speak a geek inside production we're sitting with special guests in entertainment news and tech so sit back and enjoy as we geek out together right now Welcome, welcome, everybody. Uh, wherever it is that you are tuning in from, make sure that you hit the subscribe button because we are simulcasting to Geek Insider as well as Indie Volt and Rage and AVC. Let me drop the card here so we can say hello to John O'Hurley. Oh, Peterson. Yes, <laughs> Peterman is in the house. <laughs> <laughs> welcome, you welcome. You can't miss that voice either you know uh i uh, it was like two years ago on thanksgiving someone turned off the football game and turned on the uh dog show and i went wait a minute i know that voice uh but i'd never watched it before so i didn't know it was you but welcome to the show john uh, thank you you're... thank you very much good to be here for such a good reason as well exactly mm -hmm. and that's that's what we want to talk about tell everybody what child help is and what you guys got going on this next week because it's right around the corner well, Child Help is uh, just quite fundamentally one of the most important organizations in our in our country. They are the largest child welfare uh, group that there is preventing um, uh, child abuse uh, across the country. The numbers uh, relating to child abuse are absolutely staggering. We are the most civilized country in the world, and yet every year, every year, there are enough child abuse cases to fill 10 football stadiums. That's a million cases a year. Um, the numbers are just absolutely atrocious. And unfortunately. Oh, did we lose his audio? Yeah. I think we lost your audio, John. Can you hear me now? We yeah. can. All right, I'm going to take my earbuds out. If you can hear me, then that's all you need. <laughs> but can you hear us? Of course I can. <laughs> oh, uh, awesome. As I was talking about child abuse, uh, over a million cases a year, and yet we are the most civilized country in the world. Uh, the numbers are, during the pandemic, got even worse because there was no way of knowing um, because the, the abused and the abusers were locked down together. They didn't go to school, so there's no way for the teachers to intercede in cases of suspected child abuse, which is sometimes, right. most of the times, where it happens. So we will never know how bad child abuse got during this past year and a half. Um, additionally, it's been impossible for them and any charity to raise money during the pandemic because nobody could gather. So uh, we put our heads together and came up with what I believe is maybe one of the most innovative ways to raise money, and that's going to be using a sports application this in this case it's um, ultimate golf easy thing for everybody to play to have fun with and use them as our fundraising template and what i mean by that is if you go on between august 2nd and august 8th if you download the child help package there for five as little as five dollars you'll get a golf ball the child help golf ball that will go 20 percent further so you're in tiger woods kind of area Ooh. Um, which is a little, which who wouldn't want that? And that money goes to child help. There'll be other upgrades you can do as well if you want to, or you can make a straight donation if you like. But at any rate, you get to play the game against all of my celebrity friends that have all said, hey, John, we're going to help you out. Alice Cooper, Guy Fieri, um, uh, golfer Annika Sorenstam, the best female golfer in the world, Peter Jacobson, another professional golfer, um, uh, Joe Theismann, quarterback, Steve Young, another quarterback, um, Larry the Cable Guy is going to be there, Patrick Warburton, Putty from Seinfeld, Rob Riggle. There's a whole slew of celebrities that are joining on to play, and you can match against their scores and, of course, win wonderful online prizes as well. Mm -hmm. Very cool. And how now, long? Is, go ahead, Meredith. 
uh, I was going to ask you, like, uh, how did you become involved with this, with uh, with child health and uh, emceeing and co-hosting this? Well, I've been their celebrity ambassador for more than 10 years. Um, mm -hmm. And uh, it's an organization that I fell in love with the, the, the instant that I went there. Those, uh, the two women that started uh, child help back in the 1950s um, have saved more than 10 million kids. Uh, it's, I mean, wow. the story is absolutely extraordinary. Uh, but every year the numbers just keep coming back and back and back and we just don't seem to be making, um, sadly, don't seem to be making much progress. Uh, the numbers just keep getting worse every year. Mm -hmm. Now, when the, uh, the, the golf tournament is going on, or is there going to be any recording of the celebrities uh, game or you just, does it just kind of Oh yes, up? they'll oh, be playing okay. along. I'll be, uh, I'll be doing interviews with them. Then we'll send them off to play. I'll be narrating their game while they're playing. Uh, it should be a lot of fun. It's it's just meant to be a lot of pure fun. And, uh, you know, you, you, you don't have to be a great golfer to be really good at ultimate golf. I was just about to ask you that. <laughs> yeah, I actually play a similar golf game. And it's funny, I was on another app today and an advertisement came up for ultimate golf. And mm -hmm. I almost downloaded it at that point, not even putting the two together. I probably had it in the back of my head because of when it's a wonderful play. app. And you get to play not only do you get to play a fun round of golf on wonderful graphics. I mean, the the the. Uh, the uh, the graphic setup there is our second to none, and you get to play the best holes in golf. Everything is a replica of the great holes oh. of golf all around the world. Very oh, cool. okay, okay. Now I saw something um, here about um, availability, and the first thing that came up was that it was only available through the Apple iStore for iPhones and and i you know. Um, Apple products. Is that also mm -hmm. available for Android? Are you aware? Uh, I believe that it's Apple that is going to be doing it uh, okay. because they are, they are a sponsor. And so oh. and they uh, they stepped up to do this. So instead of there being 100,000 people that are acclimated to the game, we're dealing with an audience of 100 million. Uh, so it's going to be wow. a big step up in, the, uh, in our exposure all around. And this will be not just domestically, this will be globally. Oh, wow. And again, okay. folks, y'all can go to uh, the website, childhelp.org, right? Mm -hmm. That's correct. Yeah. If you'd like to learn a little bit more about the wonderful work that these two ladies do, they have been nominated for the Nobel Peace Prize nine times. Wow. 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 Unbelievable. Yeah. I, I'm at the website right now, founded in 1959 by Sarah O'Meara and Yvonne Federson. Mm -hmm. So, they wow. Were the, they, were the two, they were the two love interests on an old television show. Uh, called Ozzie and Harriet, and they were doing a USO show when they came upon a, a group of 10 uh, kids. The oldest was 10, the youngest was a newborn. And these were kids oh, wow. that were left behind be, uh, by, by the American servicemen that left Korea um, and um, uh, had children with, uh, with uh, people on the ground there. And uh, unfortunately, the kids were shunned from society, so they had to make it on their own. They stopped in their tracks. They didn't go home. They developed an orphanage there for them, and that has, that has moved on. And they did it in Vietnam as well. Um, and uh, Ronald Reagan and Nancy Reagan asked them to tackle the, uh, the great uh, you know, scar that we have in this country of child abuse. Uh, and as I say, since they started that 50 years ago, They've saved 10 million kids. Mm -hmm. That's amazing. That's amazing. And, you know, we've had, like you've mentioned, we, we've had a, an issue in this country for a long time in the world with child abuse. But the pandemic for the last year and a half has really just shielded that shielded the abusers uh, in a lot of ways. And that was something, you know, it, it became a political talking point last year uh, when they were trying to get kids back into school. Um, but we all know that the, the teachers are the front lines on identifying this a lot of the times. They're the ones that see the kids every day. And, and so hopefully, you know, schools are supposed to be starting back up. Hopefully they, they are able to and this Delta variant doesn't start shutting things back down because the kids just can't afford this again. No, absolutely. We're, we're, we are injuring our children far beyond our belief. We have, we have no way of knowing. They need to be in school. They need to be learning. And they need to be away from um, dangerous situations. And dangerous situations need to be identified. 
Very much so. Now, are they, is everybody able, you said you're going to be uh, emceeing the, the event. Is, are people able to view it on childhelp.org or is there a specific No, you'll place? be going, no, you'll go to the, uh, you'll go to the, uh, the, the site down there and you'll be able to see it. Fantastic. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So this event is August 2nd through August 8th. Eighth, uh, you can go and uh, download the app and uh, get your game on. You know, start uh, start getting your score up and and your capabilities there. But you can also go to childhelp.org/ultimategolf, and uh, there are a couple ways that you can help through sponsorship and donations, and you get to see the uh, the VIP list of people who are participating. That's, That's pretty right. cool. The the VIP Royale will actually start on the 5th of August. So you're okay. going to have a few days to get your game in gear. Uh, mm -hmm. And the 5th of August is when the celebs will begin their, uh, their, their game play. I just want to see how Alice Cooper does on it. You know, uh... you know, Alice is one of the sweetest human beings on earth, but I got to tell you, you put a golf club in his hand or talk about golf. He is the most competitive human being you will ever be. Oh, is that like the road rage of golf? <laughs> that is for him. Well, he credits, you know, it's funny that um, uh, Alice will credit golf and he plays golf every single day. He said it saved his life from, that slow descending spiral of what happens in backstage rock and roll. He said right. golf saved his life. He said, he, I'd be dead right now. Wow. Wow. And, and how about you, John? Do you, do you play, do you plan on participating in this event besides uh, hosting not and emceeing? Will, not only will I be emceeing, but I will be playing along as well. Oh, very good. <laughs> and I have gotten, yeah. and because I'm pretty good with the finger here and I'm able to uh, <laughs> slide it up and down. <laughs> oh, uh, yeah, I'm a couch golfer myself. <laughs> there you go. That's all you need to use. No calories burned. No, watch this. No calories burned. <laughs> and I ain't got to walk. I ain't got to walk between greens. But uh, And you can I, drink a beer and you can drink a beer while you're playing. Exactly. Well, yeah. I think you can do that in real golf too, John, but I, <laughs> I have found that I can't play those games on my phone anymore because the eyes just aren't what they used to be. I have to play it on my big tablet, you know, so that I can uh -huh. actually see what I'm doing. But and it, John, what other projects do you have going on? I know, of course, you know, you were filming earlier today. Uh, what else is coming down the pipe for John? Uh, well, I've got a couple of things, you know, Broadway's opening back up again, so I'll be returning sometime this year. I show Chicago, the musical on the way. Um, I've done over 2000 performances there and I'll continue that run until they, uh, uh, until they, uh, they knock me down. But, um, I have, uh, then I also have my one man musical that I tour around the country. Uh, that is starting to book up again as well. Uh, and then I have a couple of movies. I got a movie th that has been postponed several years now because of the pandemic um, oh. that I'm supposed to be shooting in Greece. Uh, I have uh, a couple of new TV projects that are on the horizon. So it, uh, I'm a busy guy. Uh, it never stops. And um, a lot of uh, a lot of voice stuff, animation, and, uh, and and I have a lot of products that I am spokesman for. So everything. I'm uh, I'm a busy boy. <laughs> Jack of all trades when it comes to, to the, the job field there. Um, and Meredith, go ahead. Yeah, uh, I wanted to know what what have been some of the major challenges working through this past year? You know, because we've all tried to stay busy as much as possible. Uh, being online has been crucial for a lot of people. Mm -hmm. um, but you know, when it comes to filming and things, a lot of times you have to be on set. It is. Uh, what and has also, that and, been and like? When you're, and when you're on Broadway, you have to put uh, butts in the seats. Yes. Yeah. None yes. of those, neither of those two things have been able to go on for the past year and a half. So yes, I, it's been very difficult. Now, fortunately, I do so much work in recording, um, voice recording, that uh, I haven't really taken the hit as uh, too many, as many of my other friends have, unfortunately. Uh, but I'll tell you, um, you know, great things happen. I discovered um, online this uh, platform called Cameo.com. Have you heard of it? Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. Well, I've become one of the boy toys over there on Cameo.com. <laughs> Jay, um, Jay Peterman and his monologues have become a oh. great way to say happy birthday, happy anniversary, or, oh. or whatever. Uh, and I have written, 
a half a dozen more of the J. Peterman monologues, uh, and they're as lunatic as when I did them on Seinfeld, um, <laughs> and and I customize them for the situation at hand. Uh, but I've had more fun with that. I have, and I, you know, not only birthdays, anniversaries. I mean, it's the strangest thing. I had one guy that I was actually talking through erectile dysfunction, and uh, so, you know, you just never know. <laughs> oh my goodness. And are you able to do some of the voice work at home? I know a lot of folks have the You know, I, I am. And thank, thank goodness for the new iPhone 12, because, um, which is what I'm speaking on right now. The, the digital quality is, is so good that um, it really replicates a lot of the, the studio microphones that I use. Uh, and so I can do a great deal of my work right from here because it all comes up, of course, digitally and they can manipulate it as they need to. Mm -hmm. And uh, we kind of blew past our 15 minutes with you, John. Um, I don't want to take up too much of your time, but we do want to circle back and talk a little bit more about, um, about uh, child help, mm -hmm. uh, childhelp.org. Got a, uh, the, would you call it an invitational because it's golf? <laughs> Absolutely. Let's call it an invitational. We yes. want you. <laughs> So make sure that you download the app, head over there, uh, get involved, donate where you can, be a sponsor if you can. We've mm -hmm. got all the links in the show description. So wherever it is that you're tuning in from, we've got the link to uh, the event itself, uh, childhelp.org, and uh, some links to you. Wonderful. And, and what you've been doing on your socials and, and things. But uh, where can people connect with you besides Cameo? Uh, besides Cameo, um, well, you know, I don't really keep a website anymore. Uh, I mm -hmm. just found that it's, uh, uh, the, the Cameo is easier. I have a little bit of a fan club there. Uh, and that's easy. That's plenty for me. Mm -hmm. I might have to, I might have to go on there and get something for done for my wife. You know, uh, <laughs> that would trip her out. I think she's tuned in right now. Uh, but well, a lot of fun. Meredith, mm -hmm. did you have any other questions before I hit him with our final question? Nope, you go right ahead, Matthew. Well, John, one thing that we always ask our guests is if you could go back in time and give young John one piece of advice, what would it be? I, uh, I grew up with a sense of stage fright. And I would have told myself what I ultimately told myself uh, some years back. And that is that you're here to have fun. You're not there to work. So go out on stage and have fun. And because of that, I have one prayer that I say now. I walk right before I walk on stage or do anything uh, in the public. I bow my head and simply say, God, let me be surprised. And that's all I say. <laughs> and it calms me down. It opens me up. And the, the, I'm always looking for my surprise. And my surprise this time was that question. <laughs> wow. 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 Fantastic. Well, it's been a pleasure. It's been a pleasure to talk to you. Um, maybe next time we can get you for a little bit longer, and that way we can dive into the John O'Hurley story and, and yeah, your genesis. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. And, of course, John, anytime that you have something to promote, don't hesitate. We'd love to have you on. Well, you're yep. very nice. Thank you very much. Love you both. Thanks so much. You we bet. appreciate you so much. Uh, again, everybody, this has been Geek Speak with John O'Hurley. Uh, he has he is doing an event with Child Help and Ultimate Golf. You have an opportunity to get your fingers busy, get your golf game up, play with some professionals, and have a lot of fun while you're at it. Uh, this is Geek Speak. Hey, it's time to geek out. We're out of here, you guys. Thank you for tuning in. Hit the button. Subscribe. Hit it. Hit, right. it. Hit it. We're done. We're out. <laughs> Bye, everyone. At Geek Insider, we foster relationships with those in the geek sphere so we can give our audience the insider view of entertainment, tech, and more.